Hey guys, I'm actually on my way to dispense all of our scrap metal again. Well, the second part of what I had. This is all of our aluminium, aluminium, whatever you like to call it. Um, yeah, everyone calls it different things. Um, we've also got our copper in here. This is all of our pressed aluminium right here. There's over 41 kgs there. Uh, we've got a bit of cast, cut actual cast there, all of our batteries. Uh, a few stator motors there, they're bloody heavy then. Bit of stainless, uh, Christmas lights in here. We've also got in here little transformers. So yeah, got them out of thing and there's some more copper in there. Um, stainless steel sink. We've got some um, frying pans here. Good old frying pans. I thought I'd keep it all separate so that if they say, well, you can't have that with this and this and that, and they decide, well, you, you've got to separate it, it's already separated. Um, our aluminium copper cores right here. Uh, ordinary aluminium with sheet aluminium. Uh, this is all of our extruded right here. Then I've got a few motors, mowers, hot water system, sheet metal. And then up the bin, in the bins we've got up here, we have all of our copper, copper wire all stripped out. So there is two bins there, plus the centre bin is actually full of circuit boards. So yeah, so I'm going to get going. Oh, I've got some extruded aluminium on the front too. And we've got some aluminium rims on here too. So uh, let's go and see how much we'll get for the day. Got a fair old drive to put, dispose of this. Well, it's not actually disposed. Let's hope to see how much we're going to get. I hope it's better than last time. They haven't got a whippersnipper and ironing board up there. So let's go. Get it all done. that off. <laughs>
Ah, it's all good. I've just about got there. Yeah, one to go. The heaviest one. Oh, I'm just about there. I'm just going to put it in that hole there. Yeah, you won't need to come down, I don't think. Taking me six months to collect this shit. These gates aren't going to swing anyway.
like it couldn't survive. Good. Per battery, uh, or is it by weight? Five, five hundred a ton. All oh, right, I ain't got that. <laughs> got a couple of heavy ones. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we've got yeah one up there. Do you want me to drag that shit down? Yeah. over there you can keep that one yeah you can keep that one you might find some useful coals <laughs> Which is gone. <laughs> Not going to weigh much. Just, yeah, wherever. Get on the bin.
drive them off. Yep, I can do that. Set it over there. Too. I got plenty. I'll just drive forward then. I'll come back in. Got it. Hold off the bag, you do the bin. Oh, the bag will hold itself, really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can have that, buddy. Have that How much which? How much steel? Oh, you can't have that. Probably fifty. Fifty. Yeah. 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 So what we got in our run for the day, I'm liking this. I'll do a rundown on what we got. Uh, steel, $50, 250 kgs. Uh, alloy, 319 ki kilos, uh, $382.80. I'll put a screenshot of it up on the, on the screen so you can see it. Um, copper number two, they class it all as number two because I, I actually mixed it all up, so they had to class it all as number two. Same as, same as the copper piping, it was all just classed as number two. Uh, 120 kilos, $720. I'm liking that. This is a better one than the first one. Um, then we've got stainless steel, 59 kilos, $47.20. Uh, then there's bolts. Oh, no, that's batteries, sorry. 
Um, yeah, 301 kilos, $150.50. Uh, uh, I don't know what this CIL is. Can't remember that one. Uh, it's 27 kilos, so it's $27 a dollar a kilo. Uh, electric motors, 48 kilos, uh, $19.20. 20 or 26? No, 20. Uh, yeah, 20. So a subtotal of 13 96 and 70 cents. So that's $1,396 and 30, 70 cents. So I'm liking that one. I'm going to be keeping doing that. Especially with the copper wire. $720. Loving that. But anyway, thank you to all of those subscribers that have subscribed. Loving and putting all this content out for all ears. Uh, didn't think we'd get over 1700 subscribers within 12 months that's just gobsmacked for me so yeah but anyway if you like this video don't forget to like subscribe and i'll see you in the next one